I've been trying to keep my distance. Lately feel like everybody against me. Trying to smoke my problem, got on rolled up in a switch. What's good, YouTube? We back in here with another episode of Story of Trap. And I want to shout out Boss Up Fam 5652 for noticing that I never did even break down the drugs. So the drugs that I gave to my dealer was the little starter pack from Z. So right now, we finna go and break that down because we still got it in our inventory. We can stash. We got to put it in there and get it out. Y'all already know. But shouts out to Boss Up Fam for uh, noticing that in the last episode. Damn. So uh, the drugs we gave the dealers, we probably ain't gonna make a lot of money off of it, but we got that work now, guys. That's all that matters. But we're gonna be taking the Lamborghini to the shop, getting some uh, rims put on there. We're gonna throw some Forge Autos on that junk. So now we got them drugs, guys. And we got our shorty Janet waiting on us. You know, the little old school shorty. She a MILF out here. She waiting on us, you know what I'm saying? outside somewhere let me see where shout it okay there she go that's my girl janice right there y'all see her Woo! janice got that body so um we're gonna go and jump in the lambo she brought the lamborghini over here from the countryside for us guys we're gonna be taking that to the shop throwing some rims on there and i guess we can collect a little money that we uh that the dealers did make and then we can go and drop off the pack and then we're going to check out this crib in this episode because we do need a crib over here in Los Santos, guys. Y'all already know. We're going to leave the cyber truck back there. Let's go and jump in the Lambo. I'm glad Shawty went on and brought that Lambo for me. Going to pop up in this guy here to the shop. Going to throw some nice little Forgiados on her. Look at Janice, though. Yeah. We got us some nice little old school Shawty, you know what I'm saying? So let's head over to Los Santos Custom, guys. Maybe I should have went that way. But I guess we good. We can go this way. Brought the Lambo out today. I had to go and throw some little rims on her, guys. Because we finna make some decent money. No cap. Some decent money. The little drugs we did give them, we should make a little bit. That's just the little drugs Z already had in the stash. So we should make a, a little doll off that. It ain't gonna be much as we thought we were gonna make. Because, uh... I thought I was giving them. I kind of noticed, though, that the drugs I was giving them were kind of low. I was like, no, nah, that can't be right. But, you know, I overlooked it. But Boss Up Fam seen it and, you know, pointed it out. So, shouts out to him, you know what I'm saying? Shouts out to him or her. I don't know if it's a girl or a boy, but the name Boss Up seemed like a dude. But appreciate that game. Appreciate it, you know, paying attention and whatnot. That's what's up. So let's get over here to this uh, Los Santos Custom, guys. I don't know how much these rims going to be. I, I just wanted to go and throw some nice little low-key wheels on here. It ain't going to be nothing major. It ain't going to be no big boy wheels or nothing like that. Y'all know I want to keep the, the Lambo low profile. But we over here, guys. We good on food, good on sleep. We got to do this again, you know what I'm saying? We got to keep that money coming in. So let's see if they, hopefully they open. It is kind of early in the morning. Let's see him early. So, yeah, they open. That's what's up. That's all I needed. That's all I needed, guys. I don't know which Forgiados I'm going to go with, though. They got two parties. He say he just got in. I want to check them out and see what they looking like. We got to go in the SUV. Okay, they got these right here. And these. I think that's it. Yeah, them two. I don't know if I like the chrome. Cause we really ain't got no chrome on the Lambo. But that chrome bring it out a little bit more. Except for the trim around the window. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the chrome. They want three G's for that. Now that's a custom job. We'll take that. That's all I'm gonna do on this bad boy. We good money right now. We good money, gang. So I guess once we uh get these guys right and stuff and then we'll check out this crib we collect this money and get them some more work i don't know if they out of the work that they already had but it wasn't much that i gave so it should be should be done move that i would think you know what i'm saying that'd be done moved it by now but we finna collect a little money we still got a little seven hundred thousand on us we'll probably we'll probably recuperate about a million back this episode because I thought I had gave them all the drugs. Hey, you got 
I ain't give them the gang nothing. I'm on the wrong side of the road. I ain't give them nothing. I just gave them the little drug Z I already had in the stash. Huh? He told us we could have that, so, you know, just add on to what we already got. But yeah. I don't know. The rims look decent, though. No, nothing major. The chrome bring it out a little bit. I'm fucking with it. A little low key out here. But let's pull up on gang right here. Let's see what gang got for us. See what he done made. I'm just gonna park it up right here. I'm gonna bag it in so we can just, you know what I'm saying, slide back up out of here. We ain't gotta be doing nothing extra. Bag that bad boy right there. We got this whole pack on the gang. I already know what we coming for. I'm gonna see if he still got something on him. What's up? What's good with it, bro? How let me? How let me, man? That? What you got for me? What do you got for me? Okay, he got a little something, something. We'll collect it. I take that. Let me see. He ain't got nothing on him. Nothing. So we gonna give him. Hold on. Let me see. Orders confirm. We'll give him this weed. I guess we'll give him all this weed. And this is where we're going to really make the money. See, we gave him 3,571 ounces and 12 grand. So this is where we really finna make the money, gang. No cap. We really finna go up with the bread now. Gang good. So, yeah. We finna go and move around. Move around, gang. Go to the next dealer. I might just... Just give a... Uh, Two of these dealers some work. I don't know. We still gotta go around and collect the money, so go over here to the trenches. Pull up on gang over here. Yeah, the Lambo look pretty decent though. I ain't gonna cap. Rims ain't too big, you know what I'm saying? Not, not too small. Perfect. I'm fucking with it. Alright, let's get over to the next dealer. The Lambo get down too, man. Lambo running. But yeah, guys, we uh, bought the little chicken restaurant last episode. So we should be making at least about nine bands every time we get paid. Nine thousand. That'll be, you know what I'm saying, good profit. No cap. From the dispensary and our little chicken spot. There it go right there. Bishop. That's another one of our spots right there. Got Bishop Chicken jumping over here. We're selling more than chicken up out of there, though. Low key. All right, let's pull up on game, though. Collect this bread. Many more businesses coming. But, yeah, guys, this is another crib up for sale that we're going to go check out. They want a lot for this one, though. So, uh, hopefully, after we uh, do a couple drop off and pickups. We had the money to get this spot. Let me see here. What gang? Yeah, gang be ducked off sometime. Yeah, he ducked off. Gonna collect his bread and get him right. What's the, what's the word with it, bro? See how much money he got. Okay, 115 bands. So they got off that work pretty fast. We'll get him right with the crack. 160 ounces. Get gang right. I'm glad gang pointed that out in the comment section because I probably wouldn't have never noticed that until I messed around in the stash house. Then I've been like, how do I still got all this? But yeah, oh, you know that was clutch right me. there. No cap. That was clutch. I'm green. That somebody seen That's it. I know a lot of y'all probably seen it, but gang brought it to the forefront first. So that's what's up. All right, let's go drop out this last little pack. We're going to be, uh, I think we're heading towards the countryside. We'll, I guess we'll get gang right here, everything. We're going to get him everything right here. Three miles before we reach our destination. Get gang, you know what I'm saying? Drop that pack off to him. What I'm talking about. So let's go get up there. We got to go check out this crib too. This crib, you know what I'm saying? It's a multi-million dollar mansion that we gotta buy. We gotta buy for it because it's gonna get off the market fast. We found it on the marketplace. You know, they be listing 
cribs and stuff on there. So we gotta go check it. I know a lot of people probably not already checked it out. We gotta go check it out. Big crib too. It's a nice little ducked off spot too. But we ain't gonna be doing nothing illegal there. This is gonna be our crib in Los Santos. We just gotta get that money to get though. That's the only thing. I don't know how much they asking for it right now, but you know, they had like a little open house. Everybody can come check it out. You know what I'm saying? I guess I guess they want people to make an offer for it. Y'all know me. I'm going to try to undercut them. But, you know, sometimes that might not work. We got that last crib for a decent price. Ten million. I know that crib way worth more than ten. But, you know what I'm saying? They wanted fifteen. One thing we had was ten. So, that's what we offered them. They took it. We might offer them a little something. I mean, it's probably gonna be, it ain't gonna be like this crib we had now. We offer them like a million dollars less or something like that, two million less. We ain't gonna go outrageous with it. But y'all let me know how much y'all think this crib should be worth. And then, you know what I'm saying, we'll try to get that money together so we can buy it. Try to, uh, you know, try to get a little bit more over just so we won't go broke or nothing like that. I ain't trying to go broke out here again and be homeless. Even though we got stuff we can sell to come back up. If we do go homeless, we can sell the chicken spot, we can sell the dispensary. And that'll probably give us almost a, a, a M right there. We'll get oh yeah, close to a million if we sold them to. But we ain't trying to do that. We're trying to add on to these businesses and make more money. Like I said, guys, I'm trying to get to a billion. Uh, you know, it ain't just got to be a billion, get to a couple hundred million, we'll be good. And your boy Trap, you know what I'm saying, go on retirement for a little while. So that money run low, then we get back out here, do what we got to do. So these cows be everywhere. Somebody need to put their cows in the pen. They got them just run, walking the highway. That would be a good investment too, uh, you know, farmland or something, some pigs or something. Cow, chicken. You, know, you can make money out there too. Them cows sell, buy them as babies, and then when they grow up, raise them, then you sell them to get butchered. Yeah, we pulling up on this next guy. This guy right here got all them goons out here with him. Boy, jumped up off the porch last episode we pulled up over here. Man, what the hell is that? Or at least on somebody. Damn, a bust over here. Let's go on, get on down, because we got all this work on this. We don't need none of the police attention. No cap. So yeah, we're gonna split it with these two dealers right here, guys. We gotta split the work. Y'all already know, like we done in the last episode. And they got warthogs and everything just running around. Let me see, hopefully gang ain't got his goons over here like he had last. He hitting licks though, that's what it's up. We showing shorty how we get money out here. Got us an old school. Old school, you know, she got her own. But let's get game right. I'm just gonna jump the porch. Howdy, bro. What's up with it, bro? See what he got for us. He just got 30 bands. I mean, that's that's good. We'll take that too. I'm gonna break this down a little bit so we can get him half of this. Let me see how many we got. We got 26. I don't wanna give him just all of it. We'll give him that right there. Gonna take that. So he got the spot over here. He got the spot jumping. All right, let's ride. We up out this camp. All right, let's go to the next guy. And we're gonna go check out this spot, this crib. I really need to re-up now. But you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna wait till they get off that work first. I don't want to just get too ahead, you know what I'm saying? Get too ahead of the game. But you know, ahead means more money. So ahead, sometimes it's good to be ahead, but we're gonna wait till they get off that pack right there. Then we'll, uh, we'll go on and re-up. You know, Z gonna be happy when we pull up the M. We read up two, two M's last episode. I want to re-up four this time. Four M. Just 
keep multiplying. And then next time, six in. Y'all already know it's, it's gonna come fast. Cause that, that work we just dropped off, we're gonna, we're gonna get some M for that. I, I say by five. We're gonna end up by five or six. Something like this. Just depend on how they flip this, this work. Then we could be out here doing our own little thing. I mean, we're probably gonna do that too. Get us a little, a little pack just to sell so we won't be bored out here in the streets just picking up money. We can be doing our own little thing too. We have like, you know, a little money. They can be our spending money. Like that, a little money we Consider that too. Buying our own pack. We're pushing it out here in the trenches. We really, I really want a trap spot where we can just post up in there. Then we ain't gotta be worried about the police. You know, unless that spot get hot or something. They be on be on my ass or something like that. Right, we're putting up to this last dude. Country, little country boy. They're slanging them packs. See if he got any money for me. The last dude, he only had 30 bands, so I must didn't get him a lot. This guy right here, I don't know if I gave him a lot. I think I split work with the dudes in the LS. So he should have a lot of money. He should have in the hundred thousand. Somewhere up in there. Already here as he know. Get him right. What's up? What's up with it, bro? You already know what I'm looking for. He only got ten thousand. I mean that ain't nothing, but it's it's enough. We'll get him right with the wet rest of this work. Alright, gang. I'll be back to pick that up, bro. So yeah, guys, we're gonna go check out this crib. This crib in like an odd area, but you know what I'm saying? Let me see. Where's this crib at? It's over this way right here. We got a long journey. But y'all let me know how much this crib should be worth. I know it should be worth like a lot of millions. I'm already knowing that. So uh, y'all just let me know down in the comment section. Like how much we should pay for this spot if we do buy it. Y'all let me know if y'all like this spot. Because from the look of it, this crib look a little bit better than the crib we in now. But, you know, I ain't going to just keep moving like that. We just going to get us a spot in here. Let's have us a crib up here. Up here in the uh, countryside. So this crib we finna look at is in LS. We ain't got to travel far, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's why I'm trying to get a spot out there. Just like when we come from the countryside, we have somewhere to go. We don't have to be driving all the way back out here. Even though we could go to the stash houses and stuff like that, but we want a crib, you know. We don't want to be living in a dope hole where we keep our drugs and stuff like that. Police could come in there anytime, raid it, and then we laid up in there, you know what I'm saying? And that's a charge right there. The stash houses ain't in our name, but you still gonna catch a charge too. You got Z name on there. Y'all already know. We ain't trying to get caught up in nothing like that. So, uh, we're gonna get us a, a nice little mansion. We're trying to live comfortable. We ain't got time to be living in no roach motels and stuff like that. We get to the bag right now. We done ran up an M again. So, we just waiting to collect the money from them dealers. Next episode, a couple days, you know what I'm saying? We, we gonna collect that. Should be up again. But we planning us a our last little heist, guy. This last little heist probably put us in retirement. I ain't gonna cap. We might not have to do nothing else. We're gonna uh, be retiring soon from this drug game. All right, so we uh we headed back to Los Santos right now. Check out this multi-million dollar mansion. This crib, it looked it big from the pictures we see. So, uh, this tour finna be long. This tour finna last long. We 
just gonna walk through there and see. See what this spot got to offer. I know the spot big, man. So we got two miles before we reach our destination. We're gonna go get on down in Lambo. Well, he lucky that, that car. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna shoot past him. He's gone. He gone. Say the gang turning or what? Don't look like we all more back in Los Santos. Gang driving like he nervous or something. He got a hundred pounds in there. I'm the one when I got off all my work, ain't got nothing on me now. I'm good. Ain't worried about no police, nothing right now. About this crib that we're gonna check out. But yeah, guys, let me know down in the comments how much this crib should cost. And you know what I'm saying? We're gonna hit a global investment. And we're gonna put in a bid on this crib. Just depending on how much I'll say. Don't give me no outrageous price. Nothing outrageous like a hundred million and stuff like that. That's gonna be impossible. I mean, it ain't impossible to make it. We ain't trying to spend that much for no crib, not no hundred mil. Hundred M's is out the question. Boy, this traffic moving today. They out you today. Boy, man, he'll be driving like a turtle right now. But I can tell from about this area that this crib is nice. I can tell by the area. So we don't see a bunch of trash on the highway and stuff like that. Man, let me get them they bike back. Dude, I ran off on that shit. Hold up, who's shooting? Somebody shot me. I don't know who it was, though. Let me grab this bike. You see them no more though. They must don't want it back or something. Where the gang came from. He come from over here. I yeah, don't see nobody who would want this. Oh, we're gonna stash this. Hold up. We're gonna keep this. Stash this back here. Hopefully don't nobody see it. We're gonna stash that. We're gonna keep that bike. All right, let's ride. I hate when that uh, thing, that crosshair stay on there. All right, let's go on take care of this bit. I ain't know we even drove this far up. Yeah, I thought, you know what I'm saying, they were gonna want that shit back, but I don't see nobody. But we're gonna stash that right there, come back and get that later. All right, let's ride. We got them Duncan cakes getting in the car. <laughs> Duncan Hind cakes. All right, let's get some crib up in this area right here. Okay, so the crib over this way, guys, we finally made it. Like I said, this kind of like an odd area, but saying it's ducked off that's the only thing I like about it and that's the crib back there as you can see we gotta go down here to pull up to it I see people I guess people coming from looking at the crib but we gotta drive on this little road to get there gate automatically open I like that you know you won't tear up the side of your car and stuff like that that's a plus right there just a spot. And like I said, let me know what y'all think we should pay for this crib right here. Let me see what we got over here. Okay, this is a helipad. I was thinking it was a garage over there, but I don't see now. We're gonna back up. We're gonna go around. I guess this is the front of the crib. Yeah, this is the front. They got the little water fountain out there, little statue in the middle of the water. And yeah, they got garage area right here. We're gonna park it up right here. 
Oh yeah, this garage hidden. So they got a garage right here. You can actually bring cars in here, work on it. No, you can turn that into a little business or whatnot. Let me see what they got over here. Don't tell me this another garage. Another garage area. Hold up. Okay, so we have plenty of space for our whips. Like we can go up in the crib through here. Some stairs. I seen some stairs over here too. I'm going to walk around the crib first. Just to see, you know what I'm saying, how much. Yeah, this crib. Big. No cap. Nice little back. Okay, I like that little fire pit. That's lit. Nice little fire pit out here. Come out here and chill when it's cold. Stay warm. Basketball court. Okay. There must be people out here looking at the crib and whatnot. And we got a nice little pool out here. That pool hidden too. How's it going? That's what I'm talking about. Hello there. So uh, I guess we're gonna go in the crib. Let me let me see what the backyard looking like. Oh, uh, basketball court hidden. Okay, this is like a hill up here behind the crib. So it ain't nothing to look at back there. All right, let's go over here. Let's go in the crib and see what's in here. Well, oh, they got gumball machines down there. Okay. Big table. I don't know if this is an eating table. I don't think it is because I don't see no kitchen right here. But I like the way that table designed, though. And I like the little artwork up there on the wall. And the little uh, lights that's coming down over the table. It look good. We got a, you know what I'm saying, a little heat in here. Stay warm, because y'all know it is finna get cold. We got our bottles up there, you know. Bottles up there if you want to sit in here with the fam and just kick it. Lay, lay back and watch some Netflix or something. Got the champagne on the table. Nice big screen with the surround sound. That's what I'm talking about. Big screen with the surround sound. Okay, let me see if that's the end of this floor. We still got something over here. Okay, this is the kitchen and stuff, so that must be the eating table. We got the kitchen in here. Refrigerator, you know, little bar stool. Family, while we cooking, the family can sit here and chop it up. Test food or whatnot. It's got to be a little balcony. Oh, this go back outside, okay. All right, this, is this where we first came in? Okay, let me see what we got. I think that, okay, they go out here to the little balcony right here. I don't know where this door go. Oh, we got down, okay, let's go to the garage. That's the door that was, we first, when we looked in that garage, there's gotta be a room or something. Okay, nice bedroom. That's what I'm talking about. Gotta have a bedroom. Do we got the bathroom attached to it? Yes, sir. Okay, I'm feeling this crib. No cap. This crib right here, kind of lit. Okay, we can just walk out here through here. Okay, nice little balcony. We can just stand here and look over the kids playing basketball, somebody playing basketball, pool and everything. Okay, this is where we came in at. This crib big. I think we went in there. They go back outside, I believe. Okay, we came over here to the kitchen area. We came over here. Living room area. I don't know if this the end. This it in the crib. Okay, did we go in here? I don't know we went in that room right there. Okay, this is another bedroom. Oh yeah, this bedroom right here hidden. This bedroom right here is super hidden. Crib seems like it ain't that big, but from the outside it seems big. But you know these cribs still gonna go for a bag. Okay, I ain't know these rooms. You can walk out that room and go into this room. Okay, that's what's up. Let me make sure I ain't miss nothing. Okay, we been in here. We been all through here, been through here. I think this, 
Yeah, let's go to the gar uh, garage down there. I think they go back outside right there. We've been all through here. Yeah, let's go back outside. So yeah, I think that's it in this crib. I don't see no stairs or nothing. Hold up, yeah, there go the stairs right there. Yep. So we almost missed a whole lot of the house. Hey, this is the upstairs right here. Now let's check this out first. We got the jacuzzi on the roof. And we got the little telescope. Let's see, let's go up here first. This is probably just going on the roof. Yeah. Oh, we got a little chill area on the roof. I'm feeling it. Okay. And hey, what's up? Little chill area on the roof. Alright, let's go back down. Who's it covered up? Now let's see what is over here. Another little chill area. Oh, another bedroom. Okay. Three bedrooms so far. Big screen. Jacuzzi. Well, a tub. I'm going to say jacuzzi. Tub in the bedroom. Little chill area right there. Just lay back. Look out the window. Another jacuzzi. Oh yeah, this spot way bigger than the other crib. I like the little art work and stuff too in here. Little art work. I would say that Bart Simpson in the corner. I mean Homer Simpson. Oh, gaming room. Oh yeah, this house, this crib right here, a plus right here. Gaming room in this junk too. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. I don't like that art right there. Though, I have to snatch that off the wall. All right, let's go around. I don't think we went around this way, even though I don't think this really too much. Okay, little weight room in here, wash and dry. There's a walk in shower, All right, nice little walk in shower, bathroom area right here. After you work out, come in here, jump in the shower. Hey. I think that's it with this Hello. crib. I ain't see another flight of stairs in there. But yeah, this crib right here hidden. I'm fucking with it. No cap. But y'all let me know down in the comments how much this crib should be worth. You know what I'm saying? How much we should pay for this this spot right here if we do get it. I'm thinking we're going to go on and get it, though. Yeah, I'm thinking we're going to go on and snatch this up. Okay, let's go back outside. But uh, hopefully y'all enjoyed this episode. What's like, up? share, comment. Hello. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Links in the description. Gang, gang.